Pearson Cook will kick it off for Vanderbilt, and we are underway. Shy Smith from a three yard line. Sees a hole, and he will be hit around the 30 and moves the pile out to the 34 yard line. Colin Hill, he'll be dropped back around the 31. Dio Odangbo getting the sack off the edge. Pressure comes. And Hill is dropped at the 26 yard line. Dio Odangbo with his second sack here in the first quarter. Communication is key up front, especially when teams are blitzing. 42 yard field goal attempt on the way, and it is good. So Parker White hammers that one home. Vanderbilt's first completion of the game with 3.45 to go here in the first quarter. Here is Keon Henry Brooks out across midfield. Another nice run. Feels comfortable with his bread in the hand. Nice catch. Seals will take it himself, and he'll be dropped. At the 25, is Vanderbilt trying to go a little temple? Ernest Jones bringing him down. The interesting third down here. This is where Vanderbilt has struggled the last two games, is turning the football over in the red zone. Can they be better here? Seals lost it up in the end zone. That one was almost picked off. Trying to figure out what to do here on third down and seven. Colin Hill steps up in the pocket, and that pass is, are they going to say reception? Yes, caught by Xavier Leggett. How about this, traditional eye formation. <laughs> What's up there? Little toss, sweep it to Fenwick. Good run there as he gets it down to the 36-yard line. Second down and three after the seven-yard pickup. Seals. Far side, lofts it up, pass is caught. Amir Abdul Rahman with a great catch on the sideline. Single setback is Henry Brooks. He'll fake it to him. We'll try to flood that area, and Seals will be dropped at the four yard line. How about Ernest Jones? We still have eight minutes to go in the second quarter. Over the middle, pass is caught wide open. Plenty of room to run. That'll go to Nick Muse, the tight end. Forced the ball to Shaw Smith. He's taking what the defense has given him, and he's really gotten a profit from it. Shovel pass underneath to Shy Smith. He turns the corner. He's got some running room down that sideline. He's tripped up at the last moment. Handed off to Harris. He has tripped up, lost a couple of yards on that play. Colin Hill tries to take it himself. Does he get in? Yes, he does. Colin Hill in his 6'4 frame just says, I'll do this myself. And the Gamecocks put up six. Oh, look, Chris, all you need is a half a yard and use that big 6'4 frame to get his Gamecocks into the end zone. Uh, and you can tell by that Aaron throw, he was hit on that throw as well. Swing it to Harris, and he is hit, dropped right there on the spot. Third and 13 coming up. Little draw play. Get it out over midfield to the Commodore 49-yard line, but that'll bring up a fourth down. They went with Harris, who was hit by Mahoney. Unable to, per to play for the Commodores. Harris, big hole off the right side to the 10-5 touchdown, South Carolina. And this is nothing but a zone read. Inside run here. Get overrun on the outside. And a walk-in touchdown. Tomorrow Wakefield in the backfield. They'll fake it to him. And Seals will step. Has time. Fires. And Bresnahan makes a nice catch. Well done as he grabs that one. Seals. Again, nice catch and run by Cam Johnson. Nice for the end zone. Touchdown, Commodores. You want it from one of your leaders at the receiver spot. Runs a little simple stick route. 
makes a couple guys miss, and then you see the athleticism to get into the end zone. And I just talked about the guys in space. Third and six. Here comes the heat. Hill hit as he throws. Pass is caught. Here's Muse. Pass midfield. Down to the Vanderbilt 41 yard line. Nick Muse with another big catch for the Gamecocks. The get comes in motion. They have three receivers near side. Hill looking over the middle. Has some room to run. Going to try to get to the end zone. Touchdown, South Carolina. Being fleet of foot, but one thing he does recognize and how smart he is, is he understands there's man coverage on the back end. Nobody has quarterback, and he takes off because all the defenders' backs are... Obviously a tough loss for Mississippi State after all the excitement they built against LSU a couple of weeks ago. As Henry Brooks has stopped there, but... This kind of football every single week. <laughs> Man. Four-man rush. Seals. Wide side. Throw looking for Bresnahan. Incomplete. No flags on the play. Missouri's found something, I believe, and they're showing it today versus LSU. Here's a toss sweep coming near side. Harris trying to get past a couple of black jerseys and not going to be able to do it. Nice be done by the Vanderbilt defense. Strung out well. 40-yard field goal attempt. Not exactly going to be an issue, I wouldn't think, for Mr. White. This fifth-year senior. Good clean hold. Kick is on the way, and he will do his job. Carolina on the road leading Vanderbilt 27-7. We start the fourth quarter. Big hole off the left side. Jamari Wakefield with the carry. Second down and six. He'll dump it off underneath. That one goes to Wakefield, hit by Ernest Jones. It's a topic of conversation on the sideline. Protect the ball, no matter where you are uh, in this ball game. Protect the football. And Seals had to protect it there as he has dropped for a sack. He was your quarterback coach. He was, and. You're talking about ooh, big run here. Oh, huge hole. Kevin Harris off to the races. Nobody going to catch him. This will be a South Carolina touchdown. <laughs> Untouched. Well, Coach Bobo mentioned he wanted to be patient in the run game today. And this right here is patient because he continued with it all day long. And look at this speed and run. He just runs away from this Vanderbilt defense untouched. You never thought that their defense would be as bad as it is right now. Here's a little reverse from South Carolina. Joiner has some blockers to the 10. Did he get in? Yes, he did. Touchdown, South Carolina. The carry-on <laughs> joiner takes it to the house on the first play after the chains of possession, 47 yards. Quarterback last year, and they're finding ways to get him the football as well. South Carolina is creating playmakers by by the series right now. A nice job of blocking down. You see Colin Hill even trying to get a block at the end. A lot of speed in those two guys in the backfield right now. Ran a 10-9, 100 meter did Rocco. Pass is caught around the 40-yard line. That one is going to Harrison. How you played today, but you tried to lean on the run game early. You weren't really successful throwing the football. That one is picked off. Cam Smith with the interception. Ball's able to recover and seal the win in that opener. There's White breaking a couple of tackles. First time he gets his hands on the football today, and so Quandre White picks up a big gainer. There goes White again. He'll be stopped right at midfield. Did he lose the football? I believe he did. He lost the football. And who recovered it? Well, South Carolina today has put up 479 yards of offense. There's a little reverse and a loose football scooped up by South Carolina. Not a lot to do for Shy Smith, but enough got done in the run game for South Carolina to walk away with a big win. They'll finish with 486 yards of offense. They limit Vanderbilt to 249. Will Muschamp needed a win in a big way, and he got it.
Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.